Hello and welcome to Open Boosters. We're going to be opening up English Legends. Yes, I put it back into the bearish case. Crazy as that sounds, just for fun, so we can actually crack it uh, uh, using the screwdriver. Because, I'm, I mean, you can actually order these from my website. Uh, case of 12 for the price of 10, which is fantastic. Or you can go to their website and purchase one pack if you want to. Both links are there. All right, bearish cases are great. They have a nice holder for the actual pack so they don't shift around. And that's the best part of the bearish case. I mean, it's it's an incredible case. All right, so, all right, here we go. We got Tales of Aria as well. We are opening the English Legends boost pack, but I didn't say that. But we are we are going to be opening up Tales of Aria as well. Someone has popped the $20.50 because they want to play the game and have some cards. You get a lot more cards this way than you do any other way. So that's a good thing, right? You get more Majestics, all right? So that's good. I'm going to keep the foils. Now, I know many people are like, oh my gosh, she's taking the foils. That's terrible. It's taking them hose down. But, you know, at uh, $20.50 versus the $80 to $60, or I don't even know how much uh, Tales of Aria booster box is going for right now. But it's, you know, it is what it is. And it's really to put cards back into people's hands. All right. And yes, I most of the time lose money on these kind of openings but that's fine it's okay so i don't need to hear any more of the you're losing money comments or emails i'm getting um so we're gonna go down to the down cam Boop, down cam we're gonna go ahead and crack this out of it i mean i just put it in there so for fun you know see it being used popping it open you know very easy to do all right, it does take a little bit of work, just a little bit, you know, and the more you do it, the better you get it. <laughs> but these should be used really for anyone who wants to preserve their packs, I think, you know, or for box openings and that kind of stuff where you wanted them to keep the, keep the uh, uh, cards. And this is what it looks like when you get it upside down. Yes. All right, here we go. English Legends. As crazy as that sounds, let's crack this pack open. Whoa, kind of ripped the top off. There are the rules. The rules are going away. Here we go. Dun, dun, dun. The rules. The Amaru Kithkin. Yes. Coming at you live. Not Memorex anymore, Quentin Hoover. I wish it was signed. Well, that's gone. And then we have a glyph of life. Yes, indeed. It is a glyph. Going for white. Nope. We're going with cat warriors. Cat warriors for days. And we have our letter A. Glyph of destruction. So, who actually used glyph of destruction? I just put that in the comments. If you actually use this, I mean, I liked wall decks, but I never used Glyph of Destruction. I'm just saying. It's one of those cards I never played with. All right, we got Enchantment Alteration. We're flipping it around. Pit Scorpion. Ah, Pit Scorpion. Poison Counters. Ghost of the Damned. It's the new soap opera of the day. Deviant archers. Yes, indeed. They are the desert of the creatures. Well, yeah, when I target them. They also can do blocking, so. Better than a desert. We have our giant turtle. You gotta have a giant turtle. You know, it's one of those things. Gotta say, yay, giant turtle. Alright. Equinox. And Wall of Vapors. Yes, indeed. If you have gas, you need a Wall of Vapors. All right. First Uncommon. Backfire. Now, I use this a lot. That was fantastic. I love this card. Oh, man. Yes, indeed. Oh, my gosh. That's so good. And the artwork's fantastic, too. You got to have a opponent playing with creatures, of course. You know, creatures are a done thing, I guess. Ooh, Evil Eye of Orns by Gore. There you go. 
Now that's a card. Flavor text is good too. Um, yeah, an abomination. He's almost worth it. <laughs> almost. Not quite. I think it should have been four. I think it should have been four mana. I don't know. What do you guys think? Should have been four? Two black and two? All right. And the rare. Boom. All right. Well, it's a rare. Willow Satyr. Satyr. I can't sit here. But you do gain control of a target legend, so. He's not one of the best rares, but he can work. It's just that if he was just 1-4 or something. I mean, he does not stay on the board. <laughs> oh, man. But there you go. Oh. All right. So there's our English Legends. From for, for, so for those of you who watch English Legends, I'm going to say I will see you soon on the next opening. For those of you staying around for Tales of Aria, let's do this. Let me, let me go ahead and take care of these. All right. I'll be right with you. Most of these were nicely centered, but some of the putting on the edges were terrible. Well, the corners especially. But, here we go. Nice and silky smooth. Alright, here we go. Aria. Wait, where's my little thing? There it is. And the slice. Oh my god. Alright. Dun, dun, dun. The tails. Dun, dun, dun. The Aria. All right, what are we getting, guys? All right. There's the box. And here are the packs. Dun, dun, dun. How y'all doing today? Are you doing good? Bring this a little closer. All right. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Bolton shot. Seek and destroy. Yes, indeed. There you go. Your first majestic. Merging avalanche. Mark of lightning. Overflex. Old Hind. Mm -hmm. Titan's Fist. Evergreen. Evergreen Terrorist. No. No, not quite. Sigil. And Singing Steel Blade. See, that foil is cool, right? You got that right. That was beautiful. It's common, but still beautiful. You know what I mean? They're saying there, I thought I wasn't recording. <laughs> I was like, oh no! <laughs> I, look, I looked over, looked at the wrong spot. I was like, my heart just jumped. I was like, I've opened a Legends pack and I wasn't recording. Oh my goodness. And this would become my box for sure. All right, turn timber. Bolton shot. Nice rare there. All right. We don't want any more rotten bolt, <laughs> rotten uh, bucklers. In one case, I had two of them. Two of them were the cool pools there. Don't need any more of those. All right, so if you're a fan of flesh and blood, highly recommend uh making any comment to make this make this thing oh, oh there you go flicker wisp all right all right mm -hmm. 
make it go a little bit farther inside the uh, range of people watching. You know, so the more people that watch this to the end, the runtime, that kind of stuff, all takes account of how many people will actually get to see it. And if the more comments you make, the more people will see or at least get exposed to Flesh and Blood. And me attaching it to uh, Match the Gathering is getting some Match the Gathering people interested. So let's hope that continues. Dun, 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 dun. Hopefully I can get some Dynasty boxes and a new, a new set coming out. But I always have to wait. That's the thing. I should have to wait. Rare Flash Weave Ice. That is a cool foil. I don't have this one. That's gorgeous. I know it's only a rare, sorry, but still. That one. Oh, there we go. There we go. There's our majestic foil. Pulse it and slot. Okay, that was a good pack. That's that was probably the best pack of our box, of course. Weave Lightning, Plosive, and Overflex. Winter's Bite. Hit the winner. Cold Wave. Rites of Lightning. Very. Yeah, this this way is actually a great way for uh, people to come into the game. Get the feel of it. Inspire the lightning of it. Mark of lightning. For us, lightning. Oh, there you go. Tear Strike. Nice Majestic there. And Buzz Bolt. Buzz Bolt. Chill to the bone. More Sigil. More frost rain. Well, not more frost rain for this person, but it is frost rain. <laughs> we'll probably hit a few more. Evergreen. Okay, there we go. I'm bolden. Deep blue. <laughs> All right. Mm. Oops. My bad. Emboldened to you, sir. 
and a blossoming spoil blade. Boom. There we go, up to four. That's good. Plenty of time for the others. Oh, that got damage. At least it was a token. Is that considered a misprint? I don't know. Dead again. Press lightning. Snapshot. Entangle. Swain Hines. <laughs> Sigil. Flash. Winter's Bite. Oh, there we go. We got our common suede hides. Look at that. I think that's the first one we've pulled on the actual channel. It's not the first that I've pulled off the channel. But there we go. <laughs> Bolt and shot. Evergreen. We've landed. Come on. Where does my lake ring? Well, not my lake, but their lake. Light it up. <laughs> And Arcane, sh Arcanic Shockwave. What are you, five? Could be at least one more. <laughs> Possibly. Ice Quick. Cold Wave. Entwine Lightning. I'm pretty sure that was my fault. There you go. I'm putting that in your pile. Damn it. I think we would have done that. All right. Summer Shelter. Turn. Blizzard Bolt. Crescendo. <laughs> Entwine Lightning. Explosive Growth. Endless Winter. Not the one I was looking for, though. And an Evergreen. Cosmic Surge. Really hoping we get the. We haven't pulled one yet. Okay, Byingale, Weave Earth, Winter's Grasp. Last few remaining packs. I think I think we're out of the gas. 
Uh, I'm pretty sure we don't have anything more. We got Rites of Lightning. Weave Lightning. Oh, we do have a Majestic. We have a Sting of Sorcery. Nice. All right. Two Foil Majestics this time. We're all a good fox. Anything. Frostfang, Weep Ice, Rites of Replenishment. Dun, 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 dun. Last pack, box stop and pound. We got some Frostbite. Rust Lightning, Snapshot, and Entwine Ice. A fist. All right, there we go. Another damage card. So good. At least it was a common. All right, hit the like button, subscribe, make a comment. Don't know why I put those there. What should we over here? All right. I'm going to the suede shoes because I think I bet that comment at the top of the cards. All right. I will see you all on the next one. Hit the like button, subscribe, make a comment. I'll talk to you again in the future.